Nicaragua to Steppe. This is Maria Garcia. Together with her six children, she lives in the Tustepi region near Managua, the capital of Nicaragua, the third poorest country in South America. Over 80% of the rural population has no access to clean drinking water. For Maria Garcia, it is part of everyday life to leave her children unattended and to spend hours walking to a water source several kilometers away to get water for her family. Why? Because the water in her village is muddy and contaminated with parasites. In the year 2009, Asofenix constructed this project of water potable. The Azo Phoenix project began in 2009. By now, 78 homes are benefiting from it. Before, our wives and children had to walk several kilometers to go to the water spring. There were three or four drinking water springs, but often they were dirty or even dried up. Now we have access to clean drinking water. That means that we have better sanitary conditions all year round. It is easier to do laundry. We can take a bath at home and, most importantly, we have clean drinking water. This is why Green Empowerment and Asofenix installed three solar-powered pumps and, together with the inhabitants of the village, laid water lines to the villagers. This way, more than 1,000 people now have access to clean drinking water. No CO2 was produced and the environment was not damaged by this life-saving project. Having water here in the community means great progress, especially for our children. They used to go to school and be dirty simply because we didn't have enough water at home to keep everyone clean. Now they can take a bath and be clean every day when they leave home in the morning to go to school. For Maria Garcia and the other women from these villages, life has become a bit easier. They now have more time for themselves and can take better and more efficient care of their household, the children, preparing meals, the old people and gathering firewood. Thanks to this new form of luxury, life in the Tustepi region has undergone a sustainable change. The inhabitants of the villages can now take a bath, wash their laundry, and even water their small front yards without having a guilty conscience. Also, the villagers now get electricity via small-scale hydropower stations, which provide the people with an additional benefit. The Tustepi project has already encouraged imitation, Similar solar pump installations are being built in the Philippines, as well as in Ecuador. There is no limit to the spreading of this idea. Clean water, villagers whose inhabitants were only able to dream about it for hundreds of years, can now live their dream. Green Empowerment and Asophenix, well-deserved winners in the water category.